In this problem, you were told the highway is straight and it makes a steep descent towards a city. So you're given a diagram that looks like this, and then they give you a grade. So in this particular problem, the grade is 6%. So what the grade tells you is the slope of this particular highway. So the key here is knowing the definition of slope. So our slope, we define loosely as our rise divided by our run. So the rise tells us how far we go up or how far we go down. So if we're looking at our picture of the highway, here's our rise. And then it's divided by our run. So our run is how we're moving horizontally. So they tell us that with a 6% grade, that means our slope is negative 6 over 100. So we descend 6 feet for every 100 feet that we move horizontally. And they said if we descended a distance of 1,100, so that's telling us the rise part. And they're asking us what's the change in our horizontal distance. So that's where we're looking for the run. So what we have set up is called a proportion. And the way that we solve proportions is we cross multiply. So we're going to multiply on these diagonals. So we take negative 6 and multiply it by x. And we multiply our other diagonal, 1100, by 100. So in order to get x by itself, now what we need to do is to divide both sides by negative 6. And we have x is, well, we forgot one thing. So it's descended a distance of 1,100. So this should be also negative, which means that's negative. And a negative divided by a negative gives us a positive. So we have 18,333.33 feet. And our directions in the problem say round to the nearest whole number. So rounding to the nearest whole number is here. We look at the number behind it. Since it's less than 5, then we don't change. So that means we've gone a horizontal distance of 18,333 feet. Made with DoodleCast Pro.